Hello, everybody. We are back here on Call of the Wild, the Angler. Today, we are going to be going after the legendary catfish, Big Larry, because his location has been discovered for the week. This time around, he is right over here by the bridge, so we're going to go ahead and attempt to get him today for the very first time using a one-out hook as well as the cheese, and then we've got a uh, kind of mid-level setup here. I can't exactly get the best of the best because I don't have the uh, tokens and uh, reputation and stuff yet required to get them. But we've got a 22-pound max drag uh, reel. We've got the mission rod from um, Troll Sport. So this rod is one of the better ones that you can get if you don't want to purchase anything. There is one rod that's better, but again, I don't have the tokens and stuff to get it yet. We also have the 33-pound fluorocarbon as well as the uh, glowing float, uh, one-out hook, and cheese. So we're going to try this today and see if we can manage to hook into him. If not, then it is what it is, but we're going to give it our best shot. Now, it's been a while. Oh my gosh, there we go. We already have him. I was just about to say, it has been a while since uh, I've gone after a legendary. All right, let's crank up that drag as much as we can. There we go. Oh, Larry is going to be ripping that line out. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Larry is taking us for a ride right now. Holy man, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be very, very interesting. Let's see if we can raise the drag at all. I think that should be good. I think we should be okay right there. He is really pulling line out though. Well, anyway, as I was saying until uh, Larry came over and bit, we have not got any of the recent uh, legendaries just due to the low amount of time that I was spending on the game pre-update. And uh, the fact that the recent legendaries that have been in rotation have been some of the tougher ones like Sidewinder, which can take literal hours to find. And I mean, I even know people that have spent 30 plus hours and never managed to get him. So I haven't really got any of the recent legendaries. This will be the first one that we've got in a while. And uh, for it to be Big Larry is great. We need to we need to lower the tension. Oh, my gosh. Are we at the are we at the end? We are, we are at the very end of our line. Please, Larry, don't do it to us. I should probably go with a different reel. That was, well, that was soul crushing. Yeah, I see why this is not a good reel to go with. Well, take two this time with a uh, better reel that is, uh, has a higher line capacity as well as a thinner line so we can hopefully fit a lot more on the spool and not get completely spooled like we just did we'll see how it goes though this uh very well could take us a bit it very well could take a bit since i don't have the maxed out rod and reel one eternity later there we go larry is finally going for it once again take two can we land him this time there we go larry is on and of course, you know he's going to be ripping line out. Let's see if we can tighten the tension a bit. I've got him in kind of an interesting spot this time, so I think we may have a little bit of a better chance. Maybe? The question is, what direction is Larry going to decide to run in? This time we came a little bit uh, more prepared. We've got ourselves a uh, reel with a higher capacity as well as some better line or uh, not really better line, but braids. So we should be able to uh, fit more on the spool. As far as I know, I'm not 100% sure if that's how it works in Angler, but that should be the case since it does have a thinner diameter. So hopefully we've got more line on here this time and won't get spooled as easily because Larry is uh, he's definitely giving us a run for our money here. He definitely is. And there he goes, Larry taking a big run. Let's uh, just prank him in as hard as we can. He has now took us out to 160 feet. This is about where we uh, got spooled last time. So thankfully we uh, decided to change our tackle a little bit and this will hopefully help us out here. You know, I think I should be able to go to 95. There we go, 95% drag. That should be good. Man, Larry just keeps on running. He's out to over 260 feet, and I don't think he's going to stop anytime soon. 
Yeah, he's out at 275, and he just keeps on going. Oh my gosh, this is uh, yeah, this uh, this could still end up being bad, because he is still just ripping line out like crazy. This is an insane fight. This is a uh, way more of a strong fight than uh, Cal Paul the Dominator was over on a uh, troll sport. As of now, that's one of the only two legendaries that I've been able to cut, uh, catch. We did get Goldstein a while back, but uh, that was over two months ago at this point, if I'm not mistaken. Been a while since we've uh, landed a legendary fish, and Big Larry might be the uh, toughest one that I've gone for. I actually don't know what his weight is in comparison to um, Cal Paul the Dominator, because I have not took a look at that. But I had seen that people were getting him here. So we decided to come out and try to get him as well. Let's hope that we can seal the deal. This is definitely becoming a very tough fight, though. We could be out here for a while. Yeah, we're just kind of at a stalemate at 325. At this point, it's been about two minutes of him just sitting around at about 325. We need to see if we can start gaining on him, but... I, I don't feel like that's going to happen anytime soon. So I actually just looked it up as I'm uh, fighting him. Big Larry is around 64 pounds. So yeah, this is definitely the biggest fish we've ever gone for in terms of legendaries. So we're in for a very long fight. The people that are using the best gear in the game still take 11 minutes to uh, bring him in. So yeah, with us having a reel that is... Nowhere near as good as that. This could be a while. This uh, this could be a while. We've gained 0.4 on him though, so progress, I guess. Okay, okay, we're gaining a little. We're gaining a little bit on Larry. Just a tiny bit, but it's something. I'll take it. Maybe we have tired him out finally. It's very possible we may have... I mean, he's not really giving us a big fight now. I suppose when he gets close, he might have a second wind and just run out. Because that's what uh, that's what the Dominator did. I don't know uh, what type of unique traits Larry has in comparison to uh, what the Dominator did. Because each of these legendaries has different traits. Like some of them will have a, a second burst of speed when they get close and see you. Either way, it looks like we're getting him in, which is nice. I'm glad to see we're actually making some progress finally. This might actually be the strategy. We might have to pump the rod a little bit. Yeah, this might be the strategy. We're going to have to kind of keep doing that to get him in. Seems to be the only way that we're getting him to uh, come in a little bit. Yeah, this is going to be the strategy. There we go. We're getting him in a little bit. Now he's actually coming in on his own. You know, fights like these just make me wonder what it will be like if the angler ever gets stuff like sharks added to the game. Some type of salt water, water location with massive sharks and stuff and a really heavy deep sea gear would be insane. And I mean, if we've got fights like this currently with just stuff like Big Larry, could you imagine what those fights would be like? We have got him almost close enough to where we can finally see him and get our first look at Big Larry up close. This is a huge moment for us. Oh, oh, there he goes. He's running. I had a feeling that would happen. I had a feeling that that would happen the second that he uh, got close to us. He saw the boat and he dipped out. This is insane. He's already back out to 200 feet. Oh my gosh. And just when I thought that we were going to get close to getting him in. Now he's all the way out there again. Oh my gosh. I just had a major game stutter and it's got me a little bit worried. Got me a little bit worried that uh, we might crash at some point, which would be very unfortunate after the amount of time that we have spent reeling this fish in. Like if I crash now, I don't know if I'll come back and try to get him again. That would just be soul crushing. There we go. Larry's actually coming in pretty quickly now. Looking at uh, about a foot every two seconds or so. So we're definitely getting close. I hope that this is the end. I hope that we finally got him reeled in. 
So we're getting close to where he ran last time. I believe it got down to like 45 and then he darted off. So that happens again. I'm going to be incredibly sad. And we're there. We're down to 40 and he has not darted off. Maybe we're good finally. Maybe we finally got big Larry. I cannot believe it. We may finally have Larry. Here he comes. There he is, Big Larry. Oh. My gosh. Come on, Larry. Let us land you. We did it! Yes! <laughs> Finally! Big Larry has been caught. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 25 minute fight on decently light tackle for the situation. Oh my gosh. Larry has been caught. Oh my gosh. I wish the lighting was better, but other than that, this is a success. We got Larry. And look at that crazy score, 38,548. Oh my gosh, that's insane. And just from that catch alone, we got 85% to our mastery on the cheese, as well as 42% added to our mastery on uh, the mission reel from Troll Sport. That's crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Well, everybody, thank you so much for watching this video. We have finally caught Big Larry. It took us an incredibly long time. We failed the first attempt and the second attempt we got him after 25 minutes of fighting. This was honestly an insane catch. I, I still can't believe that we managed to accomplish this, but we did it. We finally did it. Thank you all for being here. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing as well as uh, leaving a like and comment down below to let me know that you enjoy the content. And uh, yeah, I will see you all in the next one with Quite a bit more angler content coming in the future. Peace.